Here's how I paint two small canvases at once. I did this in uh, fast speed because mostly I want to show you that I set up a cardboard uh, piece of paper behind the, uh, the two canvases. So that goes on first onto my easel and then I slip the two canvases on top of that and it works really, really well. Uh, and then I just start at it. Um, once again, we're working with a palette knife. And in this case, I mixed uh, French ultramarine blue with some black. And of course, a little bit of water, how I get the drips. Very, very simple. Not too many drips. Um, we want to let the bulk of the painting be the center part. And then using a little paper towel to smooth and wipe over. And here is a little tiny liner brush. Um, did not add paint, just used water and broke up the paint that was already existing on the canvas. And you can see it makes a lovely light blue color. Um, so that's how you get um, a third color without having to add any more paint. and gives a nice translucent look to your work. And then of course, wiping over with some plain titanium white and cutting into the picture to carve out an image. This painting was a lot of fun to do. Um, it's a nice, simple, easy one. I hope you'll try it. And it, it is a diptych. That it means it's two paintings uh, that relate to one another but are different from each other. Two paintings are a lot of fun to create in this manner because um, you're able to see them both at once. Um, and then, you know what? They're a lot of fun to sell too because a lot of times collectors will purchase one and then they'll come back and say, you know, I, I think I'd like to have the, the mate to that piece. So you get to have two sales uh, from one painting session. And of course, yum, adding a little bit of water here for those luscious drips. This is the finished product, um, but that was how I started it. I hope you'll, you'll give a painting diptych a shot.